A warning tonight for anyone who ordered glasses to see the total solar eclipse. A major online retailer is telling customers to not wear them. Channel 3's Michelle Heron has what you need to do before next week. Some already have their special glasses for next week's total solar eclipse. But if you got yours off of Amazon, you want to check your email because they might not be safe. These are the solar eclipse glasses. Ladarian Simpson says he bought off Amazon a couple weeks ago. I bought them from Amazon for a pack of 10 for $5. Thought it was a great deal. Simpson thought they were safe to wear during next week's total solar eclipse because the order title stated the glasses were ISO certified. Now he has to throw them out after getting this email from Amazon. The glasses that you ordered are not qualified to look at the sun during the eclipse and please throw them away and we'll refund you and give you a balance from Amazon. Channel 3 has confirmed Amazon did send the emails to customers who ordered from suppliers that Amazon has not received confirmation that was sourced from a recommended manufacturer. The email states not to use the glasses to view the sun or eclipse. It can actually damage the retina of the eye, burn the retina of the eye. They can do permanent damage and it can lead to blindness. It's a big deal. Cindy Henderson, president of Eye Your Optical, says someone's eyes can be seriously damaged if not protected properly. Now you can make sure your glasses are safe. First, check your email if you ordered your glasses off of Amazon. Also, check your glasses for an ISO number. ISO 12312-2 is an international safety code. They have to have that. You also want to make sure your glasses were made from a manufacturer recommended by NASA. There are two things that you want to look for on the inside of your glasses. First of all, make sure it has that special ISO code. Also, make sure it has the company that manufactured your glasses. We have all of this information inside the WRCB app. For now, reporting in Chattanooga, I'm Michelle Heron, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.